Hello and welcome to Blue Sky Graphics. We are honoured to have you with us. Here at Blue Sky Graphics, we are a leading online graphic design school led by industry and expert leading tutors delivering one-to-one -one online classes. We've been teaching for just over 10 years, enhancing creative curiosities and preparing future graphic designers for the real world. Driven by passion and performance, we are purely dedicated to the art of graphic design. Our website and enrolment registration information can be found at bleeskygraphics.co.uk. So here in this video, we're going to be using um, Sepia. We're going to be creating an old image with Photoshop um, that evokes um, sort of an antique-like um, feeling with the Sepia effect. Um, so we're turning a photo into black and white, um, moving the image to a slide which will give this an effect of it being quite nostalgic and old. Um, sepia toning gives images an antique feel. Um, according to colour psychology, colours can evoke psychological reactions and influence how people feel and behave. Um, sepia tends to feel like um, a solid sort of um, earthy, nostalgic colour. Um, and we're doing this in Photoshop. Um, for those of you that don't know, Photoshop is used by um, many companies um, for varied branding and marketing purposes. Um, pictures in Photoshop can be edited and captured um, through camera and then edited later on um, to improve the quality. Um, shadows or colours um, can be subtly adjusted to ensure that the appeal of the images um, is uh, heightened um, and uh, it's it's possible to, to make a photo look professional without um, paying a professional artist just by tweaking it yourself using Photoshop. Um, Photoshop really is fantastic. It lets you create fantastic graphics for lots of different purposes. Um, like in this vid video, we're, um, we're designing uh, black and white and sepia. Um, you can design uh, things in Photoshop for books, covers, brochures, flyers, promotional stuff, um, other brand building materials. Um, and we teach Photoshop as part of our graphic design course along with Adobe Illustrator and Adobe InDesign. If you do have any questions, please get in touch with us. Thank you and bye-bye.